Hello everybody, I'm your special be a blessing. This is a reading for my Scorpios. How y'all doing? I wanted to do you a reading because you was the second highest viewed of my last videos. And this is your reading for May the 14th, 2021. So we're going to get right into your reading. Let's get into it. First and foremost, I feel like you're going to be going on a new path in regard to some things. Jumping out and doing some new exciting things. Um, yes, the pathway is not clear for you, but it's okay. You're brave enough to take the chance, and that's a great thing. I feel like somebody could definitely be doing some type of spell casting, and they're definitely using all energies. They're pulling from water, air, earth, and fire. Uh huh. Definitely manifesting some things. Could be manifesting a new beginning here. Could be manifesting love. Wanting to open up doors with an opportunity in regard to something, Scorpio. Definitely see you planting seeds for prosperity and growth. And there's going to be a lot of emotional feminine happiness. Y'all have a lot of spirits that's definitely surrounding you here. You just got to be able to communicate with your spirit guides, angels, or reaches, mm -hmm, and your ancestors. Because there's a lot of changes that's about to take place within your world. There will be some endings but new beginnings here. And I also see a lot of financial um, increase coming in from you guys. Coming in for you guys. Mm -hmm. You have the nine of... Fire, the nine of fire. Somebody's very guarded at this time. You're feeling some type of way. You feel in some way. You're in your emotional regard to some. Definitely standing guard, or somebody else is feeling guarded in regard to you. Could be dealing with the Leo Sagittarius that could be feeling that way. I also see here. Okay, so this is a fire sign coming in. Another Leo Sagittarius individual. Definitely could be watching you. A fire sign could be watching. They're very guarding. They're watching you in regard to a partnership. Some of you could have established a relationship with them. And they're watching you to see what you're going to do next. I don't feel that you're definitely talking to this person at this time. But they just want to see what's going to happen. Okay, so we have the three of earth. Okay, so you're working hard. You're paying close attention to things that you're doing. It's going to bring in a lot of prosperity and growth. Some of you definitely could be working with other um, entities as well. Transformation. This is your card out there, everyday Scorpio. Indies, but new beginning. Doors and with an opportunity opening up. Mm -hmm. Angels are definitely surrounding you and protecting you here. And I see here hmm, the Seven of Pentacles. Is then you know that there's a lot of prosperity and growth that's definitely coming your way. You did some work in regard to something, and you're going to see the fruition of it. Clad in truth is definitely coming your way as well. You may be receiving some answers while you're in your dream state. So um, make sure to write your dreams down when you wake up to, so that you can remember them. And then you can see if they're intuitive, you know, like if it's going to come to being, you know, like something's going to come to you in your dream. You just might need to keep a um, pencil and notebook next to your bed so you can write it down. And when you look at it, because you're going to see it when it comes to you, you're going to say, damn, that's what I dreamed about. Okay, um, you also have somebody who's going to be coming back to you from the past here. I'm um, definitely going to be wanting to start a new relationship with you. You have the two of it. It lets me know that you're definitely at a crossroads in your life trying to find out what you need to do. Undecided about something. There's a decision that needs to be made in regard to some offer. Something that you're trying to manifest or make it come into being. You're in your mind about it. And it's also the lover's relationship here. So there's new love on the horizon and doors of an opportunity open up in that sector of your life. As well as mm, celebrations coming in. All right, now, y'all, go ahead on. Okay, so we have here, you're working extremely hard. This is the Eight of Pentacles, working hard. Some of you could be still seeing butterflies and birds and things like that. You're good, and you're out in nature, and that's a great thing. Make sure you get the sun on your crown, because it's definitely going to help you, okay? So now we have the eight of airs. There's a lot of communication taking place around you. People want to get in, get to you to tell you some things, okay? Mm -hmm. You could be working with the fairies, too. You see these fairies surrounding you? They got some messages for you as well. Some of y'all definitely aligning your chakras, so they're trying to get you balanced in an essence. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're fully protected here. Look at that. 
trying to get your mind right. They're trying to get you aligned. Because some of y'all could be off killed in a certain part of your life. Some of y'all definitely need some uh, heart chakra work. Hmm. So we have here the goddess. You're going to be breaking out some new exciting things within your life. Three of airs. Mm. There's some heart and pain. Somebody could be going to somebody to um, get a reading in regard to you to see what's going on with you or to see how they can get back with you. <laughs> wow, people, something. Um, Yeah, last and final card is the five of water. Yep, somebody's feeling like they lost something when it comes to you, Scorpios. Who do you then kick to the curb? It is what it is. Hope you enjoyed this reading. This is a new deck of cards as well. I hope you liked it. Um, Please like, subscribe, and comment, and have a truly blessed day. Thank you, my Scorpios.